Aha! Hello, my beauties! Amazing! It's all mine! A giant Thanksgiving feast for one! <laughs> Thanks for driving, Billy. If this Thanksgiving carrot you've grown is as big as you say, you're going to need help carrying it. Oh, it is. It's going to feed all of our spring. And right over. Oh, no. Oh, uh, 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 my carrot. It's gone. Don't worry, Avery. My team finds things in the odd, odd woods all the time. We can help. Let me Billy? Just... Come in, Billy. We found an oddball in trouble. See what I mean? What kind of trouble, Nova? Uh, this kind? <laughs> I'm on my way. And don't worry. We'll find your missing carrot in time for Thanksgiving. An oddball needs help. Get it, Ed, set. This job for Billy. The oddball I'm fine, really. Just as long as I don't uh, move uh, to yeah quickly. I'm afraid that doesn't sound fine. Mind if I have a look? Uh, I guess. We've met this little fireball before. Otisco, half bunny, half dragon. This odd paw is our friend, Bunny Gone. And by the way, you're hunched over. I'd say you've hurt your back, Bunny Gone. I'm telling you, I'm full. Ah, hi. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. <clears throat> but back injuries can be very painful. It's important to care for them properly. Beginning with ice to reduce the pain and swelling. This ice pack should do the trick. Ooh, that feels a little better. Good. Now let's get you safely secured in an odd carrier and back to the clinic. Careful, everyone. The spine is a very important part of the body, and yours is a little, um, well, how do I say it? Wibbly wobbly? Well put, Nova. But a little massage and treatment will help straighten things out. Here we go. Uh-huh, and there. Oh. How's that? <laughs> so, Bunny Gone, any plans for Thanksgiving? Just the usual. Being thankful, sharing, definitely not stealing any giant carrots. <laughs> very good to know. That wouldn't be very Thanksgiving-y after all. Now, let's get a little heating cream on that sore spot here. <sighs> okay, Bunny Gone, let's sit up and see how your back is feeling. It's better. Wow, I'm so thankful. <laughs> well, finally, let's get a back brace on you for protection until it heals fully. And remember, no heavy lifting until it does. Thanks, Billy. That feels great. Great. Now you rest while we help our friend Avery find his giant carrot for the Thanksgiving feast. Uh... Missing giant carrots, you say? <laughs> yes, he grew it big enough for everyone in Odd Springs to have some. But it went missing last night. <laughs> oh, Bunny Gone, what's wrong? Does your back hurt again? Oh, it was me! I stole the big carrot and carried it all the way home so I could eat it all myself. <laughs> That's how I hurt my back! Oh, I see. <laughs> Is it too late to share it with everyone? I think we have just enough time. Sorry I couldn't help carry the heavy carrot. <laughs> no heavy lifting. <laughs> <laughs> we saved every oddball we've ever met. We 
way to go, Billy the Odd Pop Vest. Billy the Odd Pop Vest. Looking at the map, we should arrive at the secret Halloween party in just a few more spooky squiggles. You're not scared, are you, Rox? Me? Ha! No way! We Dino Pops are known for our bravery! What was that? M -m -m monster <laughs> Yep, very brave. Ah! Why'd we stop? I don't know what's worse, the creature you're describing or the fact that I understood that. Now, Rox, I'm sure there's a perfectly odd explanation for what we saw. Mm. I don't know, Billy. There are creatures out here in the odd, odd woods. Like, oh, I don't know. The Odd Springs Mud Monster, for example? Mud Monster? Does he have mud for a face? Yep. Does he have mud for hands? Two of them. Does he have mud for his left foot? Sure does. Does he have... Okay, Rox, I think we get it. Billy, based on recent learnings from my best friend Nova, I think we should run! Don't be silly, Rox. We have a Halloween celebration to get to. Now hold on. Ah! What's wrong, Rocks? Worried about the mud monster? No, maybe. Yes, it's all I can think of mud. <laughs> Did you hear that? Oh. Sounds like an odd boy in trouble. And we're just a much to hell. The, the team. <laughs> I meant team. An odd boy needs help. Get it, get set. This job for Billy. The odd boy. The creature must be close. Ah! Ah! Mud monster! Ah! My crown! Hang on. There's something oddly familiar about this uh, mud monster. Autoscope rocks. Half elephant, half frog. This odd pie is our friend, Elephrog. But, but, Mud Monster! I think she's trying to tell us something. To the Odbulance! This Elephrog needs a serious cleanup. We're gonna need soap and a clean, dry towel. Frog hands, frog feet, and now for the face. Ah, a ghost ball! Wait, I think it's a, a mask. Rox, help me get this off. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> ah, thank you. That feels boring <sighs> Happy to help, but how did you get into such a muddy mess? What? Let's get those ears cleaned out, too. Rox, swab. Um... How's that? Can you hear me now? <laughs> Much better! Hmm. You're probably wondering how I ended up in such a muddy mess. Rabbit. I was practicing my dance for the Halloween costume competition. Boingity boo boo! Boingity boing boing! Uh-oh. Thankfully, I was able to pull myself out. But by then, I was covered in mud. And then you found me and got me all cleaned up. Rabbit. And the important thing is that no one was ever scared about anything. <laughs> <laughs> we've saved every odd paw we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet. Now, 
Who's ready for a Halloween party? Oh. How's my favorite Odd Paw Vet team doing today? Great! Ready for lunch, Hakeem. Ah. And let me guess, trying not to dance with excitement over dessert? You know me! Well, I'm glad you brought your appetite, Rox, because I thought we might try something a little different today. <gasps> dessert first? Not quite. I thought we could try mindful eating. Is that when you eat with your mind? Because I prefer using my mouth. No, Rox. Mindful eating is when you take time to enjoy the goodness of each healthy bite. That way you don't eat too. <laughs> Sorry. Fast. <laughs> okay, Rox. One last chance. You've got this. I've got this. First, we see the pie. That's right. And then we smell the pie. <sighs> Very good, Rox. What do you smell? Blackberry! Uh... <laughs> uh... Blackberry! <gasps> My pie! Oh, no, not again. Again? I'm afraid so. My pies have been vanishing like that a lot lately. Well, that's... Devastating! I was going to say odd, as in an odd claw might need our help. <coughs> an odd paw needs help. Betty gets out! This jump for Billy! Keep your eyes peeled. There must be a clue somewhere that'll help us find the missing pies. Stop the odd buggy! Rox, what are you doing? First, you see the clue. Then, you smell the clue. Then, you... <laughs> the clue. Great job, Rox. Think you can find any more? Leave it up to the Dino Pub. Wait, did you hear that? Sounds like someone is in trouble. Aha, just as I suspected. We've met before. Otoscope, half bear, half parrot. This odd paw is our friend Barrett. Do you see any pies? I'm just asking for a friend. Sorry, Rox. No pies. At least none on the outside. Mind if I have a little listen to your tummy? Hmm. Definitely something going on in there. We should get you back to the clinic for a better look. <laughs> ah. As I suspected, he ate too many desserts. And now he has a tummy ache. Well, he was just trying to fill up for a long, hibernating nap. <laughs> but I ate so many pies, oh, I couldn't fly to my nest. Don't worry. A spoonful of this medicine will help digest all those pies. But an even better plan for next time would be to eat a more balanced, healthy meal before hibernating. Hey, Barrett. What are you doing for lunch tomorrow? Oh. Too soon? I see that now. I'm sorry for stealing all the pies. <laughs> I guess my bear half and my parrot half both love berries a little too much. That's okay. We all overdo it sometimes. Don't worry, Barrett. I'm gonna show you how to eat with your mind. First, you see the food. Then you smell the food. Then you 
I think they're gonna need a few more ties to practice on. We agree. <laughs> we've saved every odd paw we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet. Mama Dirtle and... What's all this? Did you scare him again, Nova? We've talked about this, but it's fun! <coughs> Fine. Sorry, Rox. Uh-oh. I said I was sorry, Rox. I just cleaned my fur. <coughs> that was an accident, I promise. <coughs> Come on, we've got to do this quickly. Mama Dirtle needs our help. Sorry, Nova, but we're gonna have to get you cleaned up first. Not water! Did I mention that I was sorry? Maybe she didn't hear me? Oh my, those are strange noises. Hmm, you don't look so good, my widow dirtle wordle. Mama Tuttle. Oh, my poor baby. Stay here. I'm going to get you some help. I'll be right back. <laughs> don't worry, buddy. She won't stay mad at you forever. Ugh, it already feels like forever. <laughs> The bush is alive! It's okay, Rox. Look, Otisco. Oh, cute little webbed feet. Bumpy green shell. Adorable orange beak. Half duck, half turtle. It's our odd paw friend, Dirtle. Hello, Mama Dirtle. We got here as quickly as we could. Thank goodness. Follow me. My baby is really sick. Okay with your baby mama turtle. Lovely shell. Orange adorable beak. Front legs 100% cute. Oh, and look at those beautiful eyes. Hmm, that doesn't sound good. Let's get your baby back to the care clinic and run some more tests. Don't worry, little turtle. We'll have you feeling better in no time. I've got the up carrier, Billy. Okay, little cutie, let's have a look. Is she okay, Billy? Can you see what's wrong? Uh, the, the scanner won't hurt her, will it? The scanner is made for odd paws. It's perfectly safe. Oh, wow. Look at all that gas in her tummy. <laughs> and it looks like she might have eaten some... Bread. Bread? I, I have never given her bread. Bread can make Dirtles very sick. It's okay. Sometimes baby Dirtles eat things they shouldn't. It happens. It's just an accident. Hmm. Just an accident? Some lake movements should help with your trapped wind. See? That's better. Open wide. Now this medicine will make your tummy feel better, but it also might make you <laughs> need to use the potty. The dirtle potty's that way. Oh, come on, I'll take you. 
<laughs> we've saved every odd paw we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the odd paw vet. Hey, Rocks. I know you didn't mean to squirt that cream on me earlier. I forgive you. You do? Oh. Too far? I see that now. Rocks! Billy the Odd Paw I can't say no to a mud bob. But wait, I just got my fur the way I like it. But it's mud. <laughs> no, I can't. Uh, okay, maybe I'll just dip a trotter in. <laughs> Whoa, I regret nothing. I regret everything. Ugh. Whoever invented mud is a very naughty so-and-so. It just doesn't go in a civilized forest. <laughs> <gasps> I better check that out. Is everything okay over here? <gasps> ah! Swamp monster! <laughs> ah! <sighs> it's okay. Melinda is in control. <laughs> Maybe not. Billy, do you copy? <laughs> I can't believe I let you do this. Team, I just got a super strange message from Melinda saying she saw a swamp monster. Sounds more like an odd paw to me. Anyway, she needs our help. All right, I'm pretty much done here. Now I look like a swamp monster. Jumps for Billy! <laughs> Billy the Odd Paw Vet! Um, are you okay there? Stay back, miss! I've got a sponge and I'm not afraid to use it. Billy, thank goodness you're here! Hi, Melinda. Where is this swamp monster? It's over there! <laughs> hmm, you don't sound like a monster. I'm just gonna scan you with my otoscope. Half pig, half poodle. This odd paw is a pig goodle. Oh, well, easy mistake to make. No harm done, eh? That's a mighty big bump on your head. It's fine. It just makes me a little dizzy. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> I better take a look at that at the clinic. Rox, help me get Melinda into the odd buggy. Leave it up to the dino pup. Pigoodle, fancy a cleanup? Clean? Why, absolutely not. My mud, my mud. But no, I like clean. <laughs> Nova, fetch an odd carrier for our Pigoodle mm. pal. Clean. Muddy. Clean. This way! And whatever you do, don't shake your fur. Now, I normally don't treat humans, but I've got some ointment I think should do the trick. As long as it's not mud, I don't care. <sighs> I guess that means we're on fur cleaning duty. We really drew the short straw. Speak for yourself. Not my precious mud! Wait, yes, get rid of it. No, yes, no, yes! <laughs> ah, careful, rocks! Uh, aha! Aloe vera cream. This should be very soothing. Well, it certainly sounds like mud. Ooh, that is soothing! <laughs> Smells good, too. Told you. Oh. Sorry, there's just so much mud. A pig oodle's fur can actually hold the most mud of any odd paw. Enough for all of us combined. Not all of us. This is what I was born to do. Yeah! Hey, 
Incredible. And it's the least I could do, after you made my head feel so much better. I hope you don't miss your mud too much, huh? Pagoodle? Cannonball! Sorry, couldn't resist. <laughs> <laughs> we've saved every oddball we've ever met. Way to go, Billy, the oddball vet. 